everyone, Fox Blockhead back with you again for another episode of Brokey in Bed. Sit back and relax, I am going to take you through for the next 10 minutes or so a program I like to use called Audacity. And what I do with this program is I record, I edit and I export sound files, sound bites. Um, if we have a look here we can start monitoring, oh sorry guys that's probably a bit too loud for you, let's return that down a little bit. Should have started with this. I should have started with this. Uh, so we turn that down just a tad more, I think. Um, and this this is the program. It's very very easy to use. You can see my sound levels here, left and right. Obviously they're the same because I've got one microphone. I don't have a left and a right that I'm editing to. And uh, to all you need to do to record is hit the record button, and you can see the sound coming through. If I turn my volume up, it should skip higher. And if I get closer to the microphone, it should skip higher. And if I get further away from the microphone, it should skip lower. Just a little bit. You can hear that. And then what you do is you record what you want to record. So um, I have a little tune in mind. Let me see if you can guess where it's from. Ba ba. Ba, 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 ba. That's all. That's all I need to do. Uh, let's stop that recording. Oh, stop. Stop that recording. Uh, so we have 41 seconds of audio here. Let's zoom out. Zoom out. No, out. Right click to zoom out. And we'll get our audio here. This is our audio. Now, if I use my bar here, and I know that this was all talking. This is me telling you what's what. And this was around about where I started my tune. So let's play that. Ba 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 ba. Okay, so I know that that right there is the section of the clip that has the music that I'd like to export. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to select all this and I am going to hit delete. See you later. And then from here to the end, delete. So I'm left with my five seconds of what I want. Ba, Let's have a ba, listen. Ba, 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 ba. Pretty good, pretty good. Now we can zoom in on this to fill the whole screen now. Well, that's a bit too much, I think. Oops. Nope. That's too zoomed in, guys. Come on, zoom out for me. <laughs> yes, right clicky, right click. There we go. Okay, so we've got the whole thing. That's the whole thing. We can listen to it one more time. Ba 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 ba. Okay, so there is a little bit of a hum in the background. Uh, one thing you can do if you click on this here, it silences any audio. So if I go like this. Uh, probably chopped that bit off too much, like this. And if you if you dial it in, if you, if you're looking for a really good quality thing, uh, then you need to have a good recording setup. Ba 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 ba. And you can hear that silence. Ba 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 ba. You can hear the silence where I've silenced the audio. So there's the they're the bits that we don't need, and then. Uh, so that's that's really kind of the recording and the editing. It's it's that simple. Um, oh, you can name your track. So I'm going to name this one um, "Humming." <laughs> uh, humming a tune. Let's do that. Humming a tune, and uh, and yeah. So that's that's one thing you can do. Another thing that I like to do is use this little tool here, the envelope tool. And what you can do with that one, oh dear. Didn't want to do that. Is you can actually create some sound uh, channels. I guess is the best way to describe it. Let's move this one along. So this is one channel I use with my videos. It's a um, it's a fade out. <laughs> I have to think what it was. Ba, ba, so I should get a fade out in the ba, back ba, here. Ba, ba, ba. So you hear it just kind of fade out, and that's. Let's do it at the front here and we'll fade, we'll fade in. Let's give that a go. Ba, ba. Actually, ba, let's ba. stop. Let's, let's do it up a little bit further like this. Ba, ba. Ba, 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 ba. 
So we've got a bit of a fade in and a bit of a fade out there as well. See, there's lots of stuff you can do with uh, with Audacity. You can you can play around quite a bit with uh, manipulating sounds. There's even effects. If we want the effect of, well, you can remove clicks as well. Um, let's do something. What should we do? Uh, we can do a noise reduction. So you can do that. You can or oh, change the tempo. Let's do that. Let's make it faster. Ba 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 ba. Yeah, very nice. Oops, what did I do? Um, we can let's change the tempo back the other way. Ba 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 ba. Very cool. Very cool. So that just elongates it just a little bit. Um, change the pitch. Let's do that. Um, from there to there. Uh, oh, it's not in the range. Uh, let's make it. Let's make it there. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. I think that the speed we should bring back to zero. Uh, oh no, here. Oh, make it, let's make it one. That should be the original speed. Oh dear. Now I've lost it, haven't I? Um, yeah, we need to make it faster, don't we, to make it back to where it was. <laughs> so this is the kind of stuff that you can do with Audacity. It's a fun little program to play with. And uh, in terms of recording sounds and editing sounds and, and kind of just mucking around a little bit, you can definitely have a go with this one. Uh, it's free to download. And uh, when it comes to exporting, let's do that now. So there's one more thing that we need to do. So we've done our recording, we've done our editing. Next, we need to export the audio. So you can export a selection if you want to. You can export the audio. You can even import your audio as well. So if you've recorded in another program, or if you have a song that you'd like to edit, uh, you can even import your audio. That's how I do my intros and outros. And if we go to export audio, I haven't set up a folder for this. So I don't know where it's going to take us. Okay, so it's taken us to the desktop. Um, if we click on Fox Blockhead, we'll save it in my Fox Blockhead folder as humming a tune. Now you can see WAV WAV file is uh, default selected. You've got a bunch of other files that you can use. Um, I normally just go WAV uh, purely because I don't need anything more hi fi than that. Uh, you can export as MP3. Um, the thing is, with that one, you need to actually download another piece of software to be able to do that one. So I normally just export it in as a WAV, W-A-V. Uh, you can add some details in here, some metadata if you need that one. Uh, click OK, and I think that's done. Pretty sure that's done, so... <laughs> Yes, so that's what I've recorded, that's what I've edited, that's what I have exported. Uh, I hope that you have, uh, you're able to play with this program. Uh, one thing that I did with this particular program, Audacity, was to use it with some kids in my classes. And we uh, recorded some sounds and then put it over the top of a silent film. So we had some sounds of some horses clip-clopping, and we had some sounds of some of a lion roaring and a, and a person stepping. So uh, that's just one way you can use it. I use it to uh, record my intros and outro music, uh, chop up pieces of, of free music that's on the internet. So yeah, different things you can do with this program. But uh, that's it. That's Audacity. That's a little bit of a how-to introduction. Um, plenty of more things that you can play with up the top here. Uh, to do different things in the program, but I'll leave that for you to explore. For right now, though, I'm going to say thanks very much for watching. My name is Fox Blockhead. This has been a how to record, edit, and export in Audacity. You guys have a wonderful day, and I'll see you later, alligators.